is how you update the firmware on your Volus Primacy or Xenius or any other printer for that matter. The first thing you want to do is you want to go to your volus.com, you want to go to drivers and support, and you want to download the latest firmware. So here are all the printers. You pick your printer. Let's go Primacy in this case. You want to scroll down to firmware and you want to download this file. You can see your 1413 is the latest firmware. The file is this weird XOX USB 1413 file dot firm. All right. After you've downloaded that, you want to go into your print center or your printer properties. Uh, the way I access that in the print center is you double click the printer. You then want to go down to system details and over here you can see firmware version 1413. As you can see, I've already got the latest firmware, but let's go ahead and update it just so you can see how to do it. You want to go down to maintenance, then firmware update and launch the update wizard. There will be an admin warning which you say yes. Welcome to the update wizard. Okay, you want to make sure your printer is on, that it's not in sleep mode. So you just want to press the LED on the front of the printer just to make sure that you wake it up and that the power is connected and that you are ready to go. You should not disconnect the power during this procedure. Let's go next. You want to click on browse. You want to go to your downloads folder. As you can see, I've already downloaded it twice. Let me just select this version and click open. Then I'm going to click on next and it's going to start the up update. Make sure the power doesn't go out and that the firmware update goes successfully. You'll see your printer has a reaction after a little while. It'll process for a little bit more. There we go. The printer firmware has been successfully completed. You then click on finish. You go to system details and click on refresh. I think it's already been refreshed. It should say 1413 under firmware version for your printer. And there we go. That's how you update the firmware for your printer.